It's Friday, and you know what that means, don't you? Of course you don't. This is the first time I'm doing it. It's Fast Friday. Welcome aboard. What's up, my creative family? Thank you so much for joining me again. Today, we're talking about easy cutout titles in Final Cut Pro 10 or X, iPhone 10 or X. Today, I'm gonna take you through the easy, easy steps on how to create a title that looks like this. So I'm gonna be doing these Fast Friday tutorials uh, just to give you some quick, actionable tips that you can use right away and you don't have to spend a lot of time watching a long video. So let's get into today and here we go. So once in Final Cut Pro, you're gonna to wanna to go into your um, event that you have your video in, of course. I'm using a clip from my previous video, which was what's in my camera bag. This is a clip of the Sigma 35 uh, 1.4 art lens. So we're gonna overlay the title onto this clip as an example. So you wanna get into titles. You can actually choose any title you want. Um, I'm gonna go uh, into the basic titles. I'm gonna choose a fade title. I'm gonna put it at the beginning of the clip and press Q to connect it to the clip. So once you have your title connected to your clip on the timeline, you can go ahead and name it anything you want. I can maximize the size here, and really get that effect going. I'm gonna take down the spacing, the line spacing a little bit, and that'll give me some more uh, room to make the title bigger. Here's another actually quick tip for you. If you find that you've run out of room in the slider bar, you can still grab, uh, put the mouse over the number and grab, and you can actually take it a bit further. This, this is with anything, this is with the size, with the line spacing. Again, the bigger the letters, the bigger the cutouts, and the more you're gonna be able to see the video in the background. So probably less words, the better. Um, but this is just an example, so we're gonna stick with this. So once we have our title in there, we can do the second step, which is basically just grab a color background. I'm gonna grab a white background. I'm gonna put that behind the title. And again, make sure it is on white, bright white. Now that we can't see it, text has to be on black. So we have our text on black, the um, bright white background, and our video behind that. Next thing you're gonna wanna do is option G, make that a new compound clip with the title and the background, and we'll just name it title. Should be in your event browser now. Once you're here, the last step is to select that compound clip. Take the blend mode to add. When the blend mode is in add, you're gonna have a white background with a cutout and the video behind that. If you want something different, you can make it subtract, and now you have a black background with a cutout. So that's it guys, pretty easy. Uh, it's up to you how you wanna play around with it and adjust your titles and make it fade in and out um, and all those other regular pr parameters you can adjust, but that's pretty much it. Super quick, super easy, and I hope you enjoy these Fast Fridays. There's lots more coming up. Please subscribe for more, and if you ever wanna know what kind of gear I'm using to record these videos, that's linked below. You can check those out. Thanks so much for watching the video, and I'll see you in the next one.